Hi, greetings of the day. Once again, I welcome you all to another video on forecasting market tops and bottom. Yeah, in this video, I will try to showcase one of the methodology by which one can forecast the market behavior to a great extent. And yes, since there is no holy grail in the market, this technique also fails. I have tested this with some backtest data, which I will show you uh, later on. This technique has some 75 to 82% of win ratio. This technique do not give you any entry exit conditions, but simply a direction of market on some key dates. I have always been saying, the more simple we keep the market, more rewarding it is. Those who are watching this video definitely will have some technical edge as they are the market participants in one of the either form. And if these techniques give you a way along with your edge, the probability of your winning increases meaningful. As I'm say, saying forecasting market top and bottom, the main idea behind this technique is basically I'm using a cycle theory. Now what's cycle theory? Cycle theory assesses that cyclical forces, both long and short, drive the price movements in the financial market. The two legendary quotes by two legendary traders, one by Jesse Livermore, sir, and another one by Sir W.D. Gann, sir. Now, if you read the quote of W.D. Gann, sir, I have remarked that, that by knowing the past, you can tell the future. And I do believe that if you know the past correctly, you can predict the outcome of the future correctly because Levermore says whatever happens in the stock market today has happened before and will happen again. So these two quotes always forces me to find out the seasonality, you can say, or the cyclical behavior in the market and few other things really works out. So let us move on on our actual topic of how we are forecasting market top and bottom. Let us see. All I got from certain revolutions period of Earth and Venus. So if you see the revolution period of Earth is 365.26 days. Uh, the revolution period of Venus is 225 days. So basically the each cycle repetition of Venus and Earth as corresponding to Sun comes out to be 1.6 days. Now what we have to do? We have to identify a key date <clears throat> wherein the major swing top or bottom has happened in the past. Keep on adding 1.6 to that particular date. In the multiples of 1.6, I can say like 1.6, then 3.2, then uh, 4.8, then 6.4, then 8, and so on. Fine. So you have to add keeping those numbers to the base date. And you have to observe the pattern reversal in each date. While I was observing the same, I found that certain dates, certain factors of, sorry, certain multiples of 1.6 are vibrating to the market quite wonderfully. Then what are those numbers that we have to find out? And they may change from class to class, but as per my analysis, as per my backtesting, these numbers, which I will tell you or I will share with you, will work on every asset class, any market. Now, before going to that particular number, let us see some charts. This is one of the chart. There are blue lines have been drawn and this blue line have been drawn by adding eight to the base date. And if you see, then the first date which we have marked, it is the candle is green. The prior candle was red and after that a sideways movement. Then again, the second line, the current candle is green. The previous candle was red. So a trend reversal and then a major trend reversal has been done. Then on third, the earlier candle was also red. The coming candle is also red. So there is not much change in the trend. But after that, it has a two big green candle. So if I add plus one also into account, then this candle has worked as this candle has not worked. Likewise, you can continue with all the other seven lines which are marked. And if you see more than five lines, five lines have worked. <clears throat> Likewise, you can see on this chart, 75 to 82% of time, the dates which you have calculated will work. This one also the same. This one also based on that particular theory. Now, what is the theory? What is that factor which actually works? Because we are adding the multiples of 1.6. So which is that particular number which works? Let us me, let me show you the Excel file. Okay. Now, uh, first of all, I will try to give the acknowledgement to one of my friend who has created this Excel file. Uh, I have shared this logic with him. 
he worked on this and we found out that 75% of time if we have taken the high of nifty made in january 2020 has worked and it has around 75% of the win ratio and that is only this is i'm talking of from 2020 but if you go down into the past it has worked more wonderfully and every time it has worked in the ratio of 75 to 82% <clears throat> so what we have done is we have taken the january date 20th of january nifty made a high then we have to add the multiples of 1.6 so 20 plus 1.6 then again 1.6 then again 1.6 or you can say 20 plus 1.6 20 plus 3.2 20 plus 4.8 20 plus 6.4 20 plus 8 28 the factor here is 8 so 1.6 into 5 8 1.6 into 10 16 1.6 into 15 24 so multiples of 8 will work here like 20 plus 8 28 20 plus 16 5th of february 20 plus 24 13th of february or 20 plus 8 28 adding 8 into 28 5th of february adding 8 into 5th of february 13th of february so that magical number is basically 8 now what we have analyzed here we have analyzed is that on 28th the present candle is red prior candle was also red so it has not worked for me but this file says that it make a green candle next day and then fall fine so if i take a plus 1 day into consideration this has worked for me then on 5th of february made a minor high next day made small green candle and fall next two days so this again doesn't work for me because the present candle is green and the previous candle was also green but if i take plus 1 into consideration this candle has worked for me so i have marked one over here then 13th of february trend reversal happened downside the candle was red the previous candle was green so it has worked likewise in this particular sheet if you see we have continued added 8 to the base date and we have always found a new date and then we have seen that how the market has behaved on that particular day so we have mentioned what was the previous candle what was the present candle this column says that it has perfectly worked the trend has reversed on that particular date from the previous candle and this column says that it has worked on the plus minus one day basis so if i take both into consideration till 3rd of april since 3rd was in holiday and second to we will take 1st april into account so thursday wednesday was a red candle and thursday was a big green candle so we have taken this into consideration that it has worked 32 dot on dot 10 on the basis of plus minus one day 52 42 days all together Out of fifty-seven, fifty-six days, and the percentage ratio is point seven five. That is seventy-five percent. So what we need to do that we have to identify base date. We have to keep on adding eight days or the factors of eight. Eight one the eight, eight two the sixteen, eight three the twenty-four, eight four the thirty-two. The base dates found a new date and see how market has vibrated on that particular day. This I have shown you for last one year. you can take any swing high low into consideration and can see by adding multiples of 8 that they will be working as in current date also so that homework is up to you because if you want to believe into particular logic you have to back test it by yourself you have to build a confidence on the system and then only you can trade that particular system i have just given a observations of mine i was working on something else found something new and i have shared with you and it is working and i have trust on this believe me so it is up to you so i will request you go on any asset class find out the high lows start adding eight and see how market is behaving how market is vibrating on that particular date fine so this uh, excel sheet i will share with you guys and uh, i have made crystal clear if you know, can have uh, your views on the comment section and i will try to reply all of you thanks and have a